my name is Feliz and I'm the Happy Star Wars Guy. And today I want to talk about episode 1 through 4 of season 7 of The Clone Wars. The Clone Wars um, concluded a while back. However, when Disney took over and apparently conversations started, they brought back The Clone Wars to kind of cap and give a final chapter to let us know what happened to Ahsoka Tano in between leaving the Jedi Order and ending up in Star Wars Rebels. So the excitement when this aired was really incredible for me. I couldn't wait to dig in. I will say the first four episodes though uh, threw me a curveball because it didn't jump right into Ahsoka's story. It jumped right into a story where we start to see Anakin move towards the dark side just a little. He shows no mercy and this ends up leading into uh, the fact that Anakin ends up taking out Count Dooku and uh, killing him. But the first four episodes focus on the Bad Batch helping out. Now the Bad Batch was a group of clone troopers that were manipulated during cloning to have heightened abilities. So each of these individuals in the Bad Batch are a little different than the average clone troopers. But they prove to be quite an asset and an incredible military force. And it's just an incredible storyline. They've souped up the resolution in the Clone Wars. Uh, the cinematography is fantastic. The stories, the first four episodes, were pretty amazing. They were a little slow and drawn out like some of the other Clone Wars episodes. However, you have to appreciate a nice long story to kind of unpack everything. So I appreciated it. Wasn't quite my favorite. Uh, some of my favorite episodes end up coming towards the end of this series. If you've been stuck in quarantine and have not had a chance to check out Disney Plus Clone Wars, you've got to check it out. If you've never checked out the Clone Wars, you've got plenty of time to go through them all. They're all really fantastic. Season 5 is fantastic. It is incredible. And season seven is mind blowing as well because we get to explore other facets of the Star Wars universe in both of those seasons that I found was quite extraordinary. Um, however, with season seven, it is definitely gonna be another one of my new favorite seasons. Um, season six ended really well as well. Uh, so I can't wait to see the end of this and it's gonna lead us into uh, well actually we're overlapping uh, as it turns out um, the Clone Wars saga is overlapping with Revenge of the Sith and we'll talk about that later uh, when I kind of wrap up the season um, in another uh, in another YouTube video. So thank you for tuning in. Uh, keep tuning in and I'll let you know how I feel about uh, the rest of the Clone Wars series and other fun Star Wars things. Uh, if this is your first time, please like and subscribe. Uh, and help me build up traffic. I want to bring joy to people and happiness uh, in this uh, difficult time as well as just enjoy Star Wars with you. So feel free to leave comments and share with me your thoughts. Thanks. May the force be with you.